Yes, and <laughs> Nigel is preparing for the biggest date of his life. All he needs is to have the shared flat to himself. What could possibly go wrong? We're here to tell us more with his directorial debut of theatre production. Nigel is Blair Strang and one of its cast, Suzanne Paul. Welcome to the cafe. Thank you. Yay. Yay. It's a pleasure to be here. Really, Absolutely. Yeah. Really nice to have you yeah. here. Um, Blair, let's start with you. Nigel, <laughs> intriguing. Tell me more. Well, you said what could go wrong, everything goes everything. wrong. Everything. So anyone who is a little bit unusual ends up turning up at his flat and it's all the unwanted that he doesn't want because, of course, he wants a special date with a very special person. Oh, yes, and Suzanne, <laughs> that brings you in nicely because he said everyone who's a little unusual turns up. Are you one of those people? <laughs> yes, yes, that's one of me, yes. And um, the funny thing is, is I was in the show back in the day when it was on in the 90s. I was wow. in the original version. Mm. Wasn't Were I? you? Yes. yes, yes, and then Blair... Playing the same character? Same character, Oh, yes. brilliant. And who was your character? It's... it's Suzanne Paul. It's me, yes. Yeah. I'm very good. I'm yeah. very good. She's great. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I sound just like her. She doesn't have to make it. <laughs> yeah, she... Now, Blair, the play is set in the 90s yes. um, and written by your friend Kate McDermott. Kate McDermott. She's done a few other TV things like West Side and Outrageous Fortune. You guys were together on Shortland Street back we in the day too? We were together too? on Shortland Street back in the day. And so um, I wanted to reprise this because I kind of love the 90s. You know, it was a special time for... Did you get stuck there? <laughs> I'm still there. <laughs> My son yeah. says I'm still there, you know. <laughs> so even my music <laughs> taste, yeah, the boy oh, band that. stuff, it's all great. Backstreet Boys of Wicks. But so I wanted to kind of tap into that and and not only just produce a comedy, but also make it a little bit of a nod to the 90s so we can also remember that and laugh at it. You know what I mean? Or laugh with it, shall we say. Oh, at yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> laugh with Suzanne, you know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so Suzanne, that's a really interesting point. So you were back in the 90s in this play. Does it, you know, now that you're doing the 2017 version, is it funnier or is it different? How, it how is funnier. It? It, she's such a good comedy writer. I didn't know she was that funny. Now, I don't mean to be rude, but I don't find a lot of New Zealand comedy that funny. I right. just don't. I don't get it all the time. <laughs> but Kate written this, words, and I laughed. No, I nearly laughed my head off Can last I... night. I actually <laughs> lost my voice like from laughing. It is so funny. Mm. And even in rehearsals, we just laugh all the time. It's the funniest. I just say to people, it's fast and it's funny, and you'll love it. The other thing, too, is we've the, the nods to the 90s, I mean, they, they make people smile. Like, for example, we've got the big phone, you know, and the outfits, and... <laughs> <laughs> and and the pace of it too is is, is really neat. So that so the audience doesn't get time to breathe. They're laughing the whole time. And I kind of had this idea that I wanted to. Uh, for people to feel at the end of it like they wanted a glass of champagne and a party retro style. At the oh, end of it. that so, sounds good. She's yeah. on there. Does it, <laughs> yeah. Sounds good. Does yeah. it terrify you though, both sometimes when you, you sit down for a moment and think, the 90s was actually. 20 years ago. I know. Do you know what made me feel? Years ago, surely. Well, Kate McDermott, when she directed me the first time, she was well pregnant, see, with the child, and now that child is in the is play. In the play. Yeah. How old do you think that makes me feel? Yeah, I'm like, yeah, really? really? Yes. How is that happening? That's right. So Kate and well, I have put our children in our play. There's no nepotism no. there, right? No, obviously not. Obviously not. <laughs> but what's funny about that is you're right. It was a long time ago, and my son came to me the other day. He wanted to go to a retro party, yeah. and he wanted to wear the ambulance outfit that I wore oh, when I was on Shaw Street. And he fit it. He fits it. I can't. So, uh, <laughs> <laughs> and he says, yeah, it's a retro party, Dad. And I said, what? What do you mean? Am I retro now? Yeah. Are we retro? We're retro. Cool retro, though. Yeah. Cool retro, cool yeah. Retro. So, so, and then this is, is this your theatre production company? Yes, yeah, so I started it this year. I worked with this uh, a core of these actors last year in a play, and I thought, like, oh, I wouldn't mind taking this further. So I've always wanted to produce something, and um, so I just started the theatre company. I booked the Pump House Theatre, and I said, we're going to do it. Spoke to Kate, and I said, do you mind if I take one of your plays? Got the cast in, auditioned a couple, and we're just doing it. And I think you just got to go out there and just make it happen. Right. Right. And yeah. then things start to happen, you know what mm. I mean? And I've really, actually, I've really enjoyed um, directing these guys. It's been, I've actually enjoyed that side of it more than the producing side of it, to be quite honest. Mm. And we've got a neat cast. They're yeah. great. They're very talented. Suzanne, yeah. how is he as a director? <laughs> yeah. He's you like can a say bossy boots. Yeah. Oh, is he? Yeah. So <laughs> those pictures are right when he's oh, sitting back there with us. he thinks he's yeah. everybody when he's the director, don't you, love? A little bit. Yeah. <laughs> do, you, do you have a 
how often you play it though, because you did the acting thing, then you're, you're a lawyer as well. Yeah. And so that you, obviously this is in your blood and you want to get back to that whole stage thing. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, if, a lot of actors start in theatre and, and, and there's nothing better than starting back, you know, where, you, where it all happened. And, you know, it's, it's the purest form of entertainment, live entertainment, it's great. And look, it's, um, it's a nice break from law, uh, you know. Uh, it's a nice break from law. <laughs> <laughs> and, and Suzanne, for you, not many people would probably know that you've done a bit of acting over the years. Mm. Is it something that you've always had a liking to? Were you doing the acting before you started doing Natural Glow? And, and Can I just answer yeah. that? It's just me jumping in, isn't it? Oh, but you, on, she's really good. Yeah, like no, you she's saw great. it display. I saw her she's, before. She's before. Yeah. She's great. Oh, like she's, okay. she gives the other actors a run for the money, and she's actually like every time she comes on, she's kind of chucking a couple of lines there, but naughty. But uh, <laughs> <laughs> to keep him on his toes. Right. Just but always, the lines when always gets a laugh. And... It's great. So yeah. she's really neat. Yeah. I love comedy. I love doing stage shows. Yeah, I'd like to do even more. New Zealand ones, eh? Yeah, even New Zealand yeah. ones. And I'd love to do a pantomime. Why don't we do pantomime? Oh, we don't. Can't you do a pantomime? There you go. Yeah. We can sort it I'll out. There go. I'll that the is Christmas <gasps> sorted. Yeah. Suzanne Blair. You yeah. can direct the cafe one, and everyone can be part of it. Fantastic. There you go. Sorted. You got hey. the leads. <laughs> can you sing? Yeah, I can't sing, but I'm very good at acting. Surprised. Really nice to have you both on the show. Thank you. If you want to dare. The headlights look. Mel's your girl. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and Q. <cue. laughs> if you want to get on to see Nigel, it is at the Pump House Theatre now until the Saturday, 27th of May. For booking info, go to thepumphouse.co.nz. I Thanks love guys. that conversation. Thank you so much for Thanks. coming in. Nice family affair, too.